This episode of Android Authority is brought to you by Norton Security. Hello again ladies and gentlemen, I'm Joe Hindi from AndroidAuthority.com and in this video we're going to go over a couple of tips to keep you safe on your smartphones. The issue on Android is twofold. There are the usual array of malicious apps and things that could cause problems, but everyone already knows about those, and thankfully, they're generally easy to avoid. Still, they are something that people do worry about, and they are still somewhat of a threat. The other issue is privacy. A lot of applications are free to use, but in order to be free, they do things like collect data about you to sell to third parties. These are much harder to spot because they're technically not doing anything wrong, but they may be invading your privacy to an extent that makes you uncomfortable. Let's take this dictionary com app for instance it is a dictionary and you use it to look up words but as you can plainly see the application requests permission to view your location and your call information there's really no reason for that dictionary.com isn't a malicious application but it's definitely gathering data about you for someone and that's why their application is free android permissions in general are a fun house of confusion some applications have legitimate needs for what looks like shady behavior like this flashlight application that says it needs your microphone however the microphone permission is bundled into to the camera permission which is needed to turn on the LED flash on the back of your phone. The flashlight app isn't recording anything you're saying and actually doesn't need the microphone at all, but having it there may cause people to flip out over nothing. Overall, the biggest enemy to Android security is simply not knowing what's going on and there are two really good ways to fix it. The first solution is simply paying more attention. Before any Android application installs, you'll see a window pop up that will show you all of the permissions that app wants to use so you can see when an application wants something out of you that doesn't make any sense. If that's the case, you can always go find an alternative. Most applications have alternatives that aren't so interested in your privacy and have a more lean permission list. Another way is to only download applications from the Google Play Store or the Amazon App Store. When you go to other sites and download those applications and then sideload them, those aren't regular and could have been potentially modified by bad people. There are instances where it's okay to download applications outside of the regulated places, but you should definitely make sure you trust the source first. In addition, there are a bunch of built-in security measures in Android. In the settings menu, you'll find things like verify apps, which will double check your installed applications with apps in the Google Play Store. Make sure that stays enabled forever. There is another option called the unknown sources box. You want to leave this disabled because it won't let you or anything else install applications from unknown sources without your permission. This is definitely among the top three best security features on Android. Another great example is when you get warnings about things that you're about to download. If you download an app from a random website or the website tries to force you to download something, your browser and Android should give you a warning to let you know that the package could be bad for you. This definitely helps with things like accidentally clicking on things you didn't want to click on. When you use your common sense and the tools available to you, you can actually remain fairly safe without any outside help. It's just a matter of putting a little extra time in so you know what's going on with your applications and your habits. Once again, I'm Joe Hendy from AndroidAuthority.com. While you're here, why not subscribe to the Android Authority YouTube channel? If you're hanging out for a minute, we have a couple of awesome videos for you to watch right over there, and they're also linked in the video description below for you folks on mobile. Finally, don't forget to check out the links in the video description below. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a wonderful day. This episode of Android Authority was brought to you by Norton Security.